Welcome back to Christmas Stories. Christmas is getting closer and closer. Today is December the 13th. Let's see what the story is today. 13. Let's see. The Little Red-Nosed Reindeer. Let's go and read it. I'm going to read you a story today from the Christmas Treasure Chest. The story is called The Little Red-Nosed Reindeer. The Little Red-Nosed Reindeer. In the green summer meadows of Finland, amid the heather and the broom, a little reindeer was born. Now, Finland is in Europe, a way north in Northern Europe. All the reindeer in the herd had been waiting impatiently for the birth. They came running, curious to see the newest member of the herd. What a strange sight they saw. The little reindeer was very sweet, but there was something odd about him. His nose had a red ball on the end. Everybody burst out laughing. Hey, did you see his nose? Red nose, red nose, teased the other reindeer. Don't worry, my darling, said the little reindeer's mother. They're jealous. Your nose isn't like theirs, it's true, but it suits you perfectly. The little reindeer's heart was heavy, but he tried hard not to cry in front of his mother. Even though he had just been born, he was finding life very difficult. He nuzzled his head sadly into his mother's side, gave a big sigh, and went to sleep. The sky began to get dark. The little reindeer slept until nightfall. When he finally lifted his head, a red light shone all around him. Not only was his nose red, it shone in the dark. The other reindeer laughed and jeered even louder than before. He looks, he looks silly. What a headlight. Leave him alone. What a mean, jealous bunch you are, cried the mother reindeer angrily. Go away. Then she turned to her baby. Don't listen to them, she said, trying to comfort him. You'll see. One day they'll wish they had a nose like yours. I feel it in my bones. But each night, when everyone else was asleep, the little red-nosed reindeer shed hot tears. Why were the others so mean? It was a lucky thing he had his mother to comfort him. The night before Christmas, the star fairy was flying to Santa Claus's North Pole Kingdom when she heard the sound of sobbing. The kind-hearted fairy decided to stop for a moment and find out what was wrong. She discovered the little red-nosed reindeer snuggled close to his mother, his eyes filled with tears. She understood the situation at once. Don't cry, she said softly. Every problem has a solution. I am on my way to see Santa Claus. Come with me. Who knows what might happen? The little reindeer dried his tears and stood up shakily. With a wave of her wand, the star fairy wafted him into the air and off they went. A thick fog hung over the North Pole, so thick that you couldn't see your hand in front of your face. The star fairy wondered how she and the little reindeer would find their way. Ho, ho, ho. It was Santa Claus coming to meet them. But where was he? I was right not to give up, he exclaimed. What a, what a good idea to bring that little reindeer with you. 
I've been wondering how I'd deliver all my presents in this thick fog. But with his nose to light the way, I won't have any problem. And that's how the little red-nosed reindeer found himself at the head of Santa's team of reindeer. How proud he was. His little nose shone brighter than ever. Far below in Finland, the reindeer soon recognized the small shining light in the sky. Instead of laughing, they secretly wished they were in his place. Now, every Christmas Eve, a tiny point of red light can be seen in the sky. If the night is very dark or foggy, look carefully. You will be sure to see the little reindeer's red nose. And that's the end of the story. I hope you enjoyed it. Please join me again tomorrow for another Christmas story. Bye-bye.